runoff rule, if there's a runoff rule there, it could be till February or March. But that would only bring us up to 58. Yeah, well, you know, I wouldn't want everybody counts the, the count Lieberman in the 60s. Lieberman's not gonna... Lieberman votes for one person, that's Lieberman. Uh, well, he, he, just happen, he just happens to be in the caucus, right? Okay. Like, yeah, right. But, he's, but yeah, right now, we, there's only 57 Democrats. Well, it just seems to me like the Democrats are kind of shooting themselves in the foot with this Dorgan Amendment. I, I think it's bad timing. I, I, it, you know, it's one of those things, as much as I think it's a good idea it, on the policy level, I, I agree. It's, a, it's a bad idea strategically. Why is he doing it? You know, he doesn't, have, because he doesn't have any pharmaceutical companies in his state. Probably, or, yeah. or, 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 or you know, none of the lobbyists came calling or something like that. I think it'd be really interesting to uh, to look at the states that do have the pharmaceutical companies who have Democrat senators and and figure out uh, you know where this battle is going on because uh, you know the, the, unfortunately there's just a lot of. Uh, 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 conflicts of interest among the Democrats, and that's what my